What's up guys this is Hardik here so we finally do have the developer preview one for our pixel devices based on android p uh, the name is not official yet and it was supposed to be launched on march 14th because again 3rd of march which is 3.14 is pi so it was supposed to be android pi but i'm not sure about that so if you go into uh, the system and then if you go into about phone as you can see the android version is android p uh, i did blur out everything behind because it provides or it shows my mobile number and stuff like that uh, so as you can see android version is p and if we tap on this as you can see we get is the android p and every time we tap uh, we have different easter eggs so now you can see we have a different color and now again as you can see we have a different color over here so yeah each time you do it it is basically different so yep there we go uh, but other than that everything is pretty basic I mean we don't have any easter eggs or anything like that then going back uh, we go into settings here and we'll just check out what all is new in the settings so first of all we have network and internet pretty much everything is normal nothing extraordinary going back we have connection on devices uh, the add device option is basically as you guys know that android p was supposed to or is supposed to support the uh, bluetooth devices so your mobile device could act as a mice or a keyboard for a bluetooth device uh, or as a bluetooth device so that uh, that is for that then if you go into connection preferences we have the nfc and stuff like that again the received file is the bluetooth files that we receive nothing else then going back uh, we have apps and notifications again all the basic things like the notification light and stuff like that swipe for notifications all the basic oreo features that we had are over here then going down we have battery again battery percentage and now the battery saver mode is now called the reduced power mode uh, it is basically uh, the sort of the battery saver mode but not actually it works as a low power mode that we have on the iPhones so it won't actually reduce the or uh, like stop the animations and stuff like that but it will help you save your battery life then going back we have display and again in display nothing much basically we have all the basic things but now we have device theme and by default it is on pixel but if we select the narrow display count cutout as you can see we have the notch on the top and everything on the status bar is down if you select the uh, tall display cutout we have the uh, tall display cutout and if you select the wide display cutout we have the wider notch on the top but again i mean this is actually pretty weird uh, so i won't be messing with that so i'll just keep it on pixel for now okay so yeah these are a few of the bugs okay it is gone so yeah again it is the developer preview and bugs are actually expected so yeah then again going back we have sound and in sound everything is pretty much the same we have the uh, basic settings like vibrate on tap we have a lot vibrate for calls and stuff like that then going back uh, we have storage we have security and location everything is pretty much the same then we have accessibility and we have remove animations option over here so if you want you could do that uh, we have vibration mono audio everything is pretty much the same going back again into system we have gestures so yeah jump to camera swipe for notifications and stuff like that then going back uh, we have developer options we have multiple users so you could add or remove users from right over here but then going back we have developer options and we have the srgb mode we have the 8.0 battery settings uh, then again we have ui demo mode we have quick setting developer tiles and yeah down below everything is pretty much the same nothing else so yeah i mean this was all about the settings uh if we go okay so 
some things are changed over here i don't know what but let's see uh, if we go to display again and if we set the theme to narrow if we go back we have the notch but again then if we go back and set it to pixel then if we go home okay it is still the same uh, I don't know what the issue is but let's see if we just okay so what I'll do is I'll go into settings real quick and I'll go into apps and I'll just quickly stop or force start the pixel launcher then if you go home as you can see everything is back to normal so yeah it is back to normal as you can see uh, one bug I found here I don't know if you guys can see it uh, but if we take a close look uh, behind the launcher you can see the pixel launcher settings are you know sort of there even if I have not selected this uh, it, they are still there so I don't know if you guys can see that but they are right over here so yeah that is a bug I have found but other than that uh, everything has been really fine so one thing uh, they have added in the power menu is the screenshot option so if you take a screenshot there we go screenshot is now taken saving screenshot we now also have an option to edit so if i hit on edit we have edit with photos or snapseed so that is a really really good thing then again similar setting here is if you tap on the volume rocker we have media options so calls on mute on vibrate or on ring so we have that then we have media volume as well and then we have if you tap on media we have the media output for example if you have a bluetooth device connected to your device so that is for that but yeah i mean i personally don't like the status bar to be very honest and the uh, quick toggles menu i'm not a huge fan of it i mean if you are if you like it good for you but i personally don't like it i i prefer the uh, whitish things on the Android Oreo and yeah I like it that simple but as you can see even the uh, notifications are a bit rounded off everything pretty much in this ROM is rounded off so yeah everything you see in this uh, Android P everything you see in it is rounded off so yeah I mean so yeah that's pretty much it I mean also as you can see uh, the nav bars here I think I think are a little bit bigger than what we had on the Oreo uh, not a huge fan of it but I'd prefer it smaller as well so yeah I mean that's pretty much it these were all the changes and what all are the new features and everything all about Android P developer in preview number one uh, so yeah I mean that's pretty much it guys thank you for this video if you like this video make sure to give it a big thumbs up and let me know if you guys are flashing it on your pixel device as well and yeah that's pretty much it let me know what all videos you want to know or you want to see about android p but for now that's pretty much it thank you for watching and i'll catch you guys in my next one